Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be my first little Christmassy one of the year. So today we will be talking about 10 beauty stocking stuffers that you can buy for your loved one. If someone sent this to you, I think they want a few things out of here. I'm just saying. And before we get started, go ahead and subscribe button down below for me. I'd really appreciate it. I put out five videos a week and you always have something new to watch. So without any further ado, let's jump into the video. Okay guys, so with my 10 items of beauty related stuff in my little cat stocking here, I tried to keep it to $100. So that's the most anyone ever wants to spend on a present, and even that's a lot of money. Like, I better like you a lot. But here's a couple ideas for kind of affordable things that you can throw in the stocking and uh, I got a little cat one because I love my cats and uh, it kind of looks like Zatchel. So let's open this bad boy up and start taking our little gifts out. The first one is a ColourPop palette. This is the I Think I Love You palette. I chose this one because it is a more neutral palette. It has a lot of everyday colors in it, so it's something everybody will be able to use. It's not something that someone with only neutral makeup will wear, someone with ultra crazy looking makeup will want. It just has a mix of great colors in here that are very versatile and you can use for a bunch of different looks without going into like maybe someone's not not someone's cup of tea so pretty cute palette and this one is $16 the next present we have is a Jeffree Star lip scrub I have the chrome one here you can choose any of them they're really great except the Mojito one because I will never use that one again <laughs> um but yeah these are $12 they're perfect for exfoliating your lips making them nice soft and smooth they smell really good they taste good in small portions Mmm, yes, and they come in all kinds of flavors. Like, I'm thinking about getting the pancakes one. Pancakes and maple syrup. That just sounds so good. These are really good and worth the $12. Next, we're to talk about, let's see what next present is. Oh, the Tarte Shape Tape. The best concealer on the market. Everyone loves it, and there's a million different shades now. I'm in the shade of Fair, if you want to compare me to anybody. But it's super cute. This is $21. It fits right in the stocking and guaranteed usage because I've gone through three of these so far and I need another one. So great stocking stuffer. I'm asking for this this year. Next present is the ColourPop concealer. So if you don't want to splurge on the $21 Sharp Tarte Shape Tape or you're worried about maybe the color being wrong, it's only $6. This is the No Filter Concealer. They have a whole bunch of different shades. I'm in the lightest shade and it's really cool. Six bucks really good concealer for six dollars next we have a body spray this one's twelve dollars this is brown sugar and fig it is my favorite scent from bath and body works mm, i love this stuff so much it smells so good and since i love in the south like everyone loves this smell around me next you can hear get my little presents out oh i didn't have the box for this one this is the uh, NYX Tame In Frame. I got this from CVS. It is only $7. And it's a really good brow pomade. This is in the color of black. But if you don't want to splurge on the Anastasia brow product, this one's only 7 bucks. It's really good. It lasts a pretty good amount of time. But yeah, affordable little drugstore pickup for your little stocking. Next, we have another ColourPop item. ColourPop items are so, like, inexpensive that I think you just make an order from there. Get your stocking stuff and it'd be pretty cheap. This is the highlighter, um, see this is the thing I hate about these, <laughs> they're great. This is like the Soul de blah, 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 blah. Soul de Play I think, but they don't tell you the color of the powder on the packaging. On the back it doesn't have the name of it, it's really frustrating. I should write it somewhere, I think it's called Soul de Play or something. But these are great $8 highlighters. They're not the most blinding in the world, but they get the job done. They look really pretty and they're really affordable. Next, we have some Allure London lashes. Now I have a million of these. The ones that I'm wearing right now are Allure London. These are so pretty. Like not this pair in particular, obviously I haven't opened them because they're not like my cup of tea necessarily. They're very even, but they have so many good styles of like different layers of lashes. They have some from Vegas Nay. If you're in that and just really good lashes for like five, six bucks. I get them at Ulta, sometimes I have them at Target. 
and they're really good. Really recommend those. Next, we have a Real Technique sponge, which comes in this little carrying case. So, Real Technique sponges are usually $5.99. I got it in the little case for $7 at Ulta. So, you can just throw this in your bag, ready to go. Really good. Because if you leave it in your bag without anything, you're going to get foundation stuff all over your makeup bag. So, I like having a little carrying case for it. But an Easter egg will do if you have a regular shaped one. And the last present, I guess one I got from Walmart. This is the e.l.f. Big Highlighter in Blush Gems. I haven't tried it out yet, but Blush Gems sounds like a beautiful name. The color looks gorgeous. E.l.f. products usually don't disappoint me for the price tag. Four bucks, y'all. Perfect stocking stuffer right here. Four dollars. And that is all ten items from my little stocking. My stocking is nice and empty now. And I got this from Dollar Tree if you're wondering where I got the cat stocking. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more videos from me, I put out five a week. And I will see you guys on the next one. I hope you have some great plans for the holidays. I think Daniel and I are just going to sit home and uh, watch movies. We don't really do the whole Christmas thing. But I hope you guys have an awesome day wherever you are. I will see you then. Bye, guys.